There are many beautiful and amazing bodies of water in the world, but it's often the best looking waters which are the most dangerous to swim in. These places are so bad for your health that you should never swim in them. Some will turn you into a skeleton in seconds while others will leave you eaten by terrifying creatures you never knew existed, and some might just land you in foreign prisons. Let's dive into it, or maybe not. Samizan Hole, Thailand The Samizan Hole is the deepest diving site in the Gulf of Thailand. The sand is very loose and silty, and this has earned it the nickname the Dark Silty Hole of Doom. Its depth goes down 280 feet, and if you dive down this, you'll have to deal with many obstacles. This includes strong currents, which could pull you down. Also, oil tankers often pass through here. There's also very bad visibility, meaning that many people don't make it back up. Gigantic, ferocious fish known as barracudas also live down here. These are known to bite humans, meaning they can't swim back up. And to top things off, the US Navy also used this as a dumping site for ammunition. So, you may well find yourself blown up underwater. If you think that giant red thing is some coral reef, then you're in for a big surprise. There's said to be hundreds of unexploded bombs in these waters. But amazingly, it's not illegal to swim down here. So if you're a daredevil, then try it out, although I would suggest against it. Lake Karachay, Russia Lake Karachay is found in the southern Ural Mountains of central Russia. On the surface, it looks incredibly beautiful. Surrounded by grey and brown mountains, this nice teal lagoon looks very inviting. But what swimmers don't realise is, this is the most polluted place on Earth. During the 1950s, the Soviet Union was trying to get nuclear weapons. Of course, this produces lots of nuclear waste, and almost all of that was dumped into Lake Karachay. Yeah, preserving wildlife was not their number one priority back then. Some parts of this lake are so irritated that you would pass away within one hour if you went into it. The Russian government have plans to fill this lake up with concrete at some stage. That's because they're concerned about people swimming in it. So if you do feel like being radiated while having a swim, now's your chance. The Boiling Lake, Dominica. The name of this place tips you off that it's not exactly safe, but despite that, many people get burnt by this lake every year. On the surface, it looks pretty beautiful and amazing. It's surrounded by the Dominican rainforests, and many believe the steam coming off the water is simply because the water's warm and the air's cold. Well, that's kind of the case, only it's much more extreme. You see, underneath the water is red hot magma. This means this lake is not simply a nice hot spring. Instead, it's around 100 degrees Celsius. That's 200 degrees Fahrenheit. So if you took a dive in here, then you would instantly become human soup. Lake Berryessa, USA. Lake Berryessa is the largest lake in Napa County, California. It was formed following the construction of the Monticello Dam in the 1950s. But the scary thing about this lake is a hole which seems to lead to the center of the planet. This is known as the spillway. The spillway operates when there's excess water in the reservoir. But over the years, people have been pulled inside the spillway. In 2019, footage was captured of a bird going headfirst into it. But according to ABC News, amazingly, it lived. According to experts, it's actually safe to swim in many parts of Lake Berryessa. You just need to make sure that you avoid the spillway because most people aren't as lucky as that bird. I can't imagine how scary it must be going down the world's largest drain. But this spillway saves way more lives than it takes. That's because it prevents water buildup which could break dams and flood cities. Before we go on, make sure to check out my Patreon in the top right corner, there's exclusive content on there. The Amazon Basin, South America The Amazon Basin is the drainage basin of the Amazon River. The Amazon is the second largest river in the world after the Nile, and it spans eight different South American countries. But it's not the water of the Amazon Basin which is really the problem. Instead, it's all the creatures that live within it. For one, there are anacondas, which can stay underwater for 10 minutes. There's also red-bellied pariahs, which can tear you to shreds in seconds. The Amazon Basin is also home to electric eels. These can shock you at 600 volts. That's five times stronger than a standard wall outlet. But the scariest creature of the Amazon Basin has to be the Kandiru. These are tiny fish that swim up your private parts. I really can't imagine anything worse than that. So there's four pretty great reasons to avoid the Amazon Basin at all costs. Eagle's Nest Sinkhole, USA 
On the surface, this place in Florida looks like just a pond. But if you dive down, you'll see it's like an underwater world. There's caves which lead to underwater passages and gigantic underwater rooms bigger than football fields. The sinkhole goes 310 feet below surface, and over the years, many people have lost their lives in the sinkhole. This has led to some very eerie signs featuring the Grim Reaper all over the caves. In 1999, it had to close down because 10 passed away in a short period of time. But in 2003, it reopened because people would not stop diving down there. The sign includes many eerie facts. For example, the fact that over 300 people have passed away down the sinkhole. And also the very real warning that it can happen to you. But the sign doesn't seem to work because people keep diving down it every day. I guess that's Florida, right? Rio Tinto, Spain. You can find the Rio Tinto in Spain. It translates literally to Red River, and that's because that's exactly what it is. It looks like a maniac's just taken someone out by this river, but no, it's totally natural. The red water is thanks to 5,000 years of mining pollution. This red water tempts many people to take a dip, but if you do that, then you'll soon be nothing more than a skeleton. That's because this river is incredibly acidic. It's one of the most bizarre environments on Earth. And some scientists have said it's more like Jupiter's moon, Europa. So if you want to get a feeling of Jupiter on Earth, then go to this Spanish river. It's so much like Jupiter's moon that NASA have even done testing on the river. Lake Hillier, Australia. Lake Hillier is also known as the Bubblegum Lake. That's because it has an amazing pink appearance. The amazing pink color is permanent. This means that you could take some of this back home in a water bottle. It's thought the pink water is thanks to Duna Lalea salina. This is a very rare and extreme microbiome. Despite the high salt levels, this lake is actually safe to swim in. So why should you never swim in it? Well, if you do, it could land you in Australian prison. That's because going to this place is illegal. The only way to get in is by aeroplane. And no one except for a few scientists is allowed anywhere near this lake. That's because Australia is trying to conserve it and study it. Hoover Dam, USA Dams are all about moving and stopping vast amounts of water, so it goes without saying that you should never swim in one. If you take a dip in the Hoover Dam, then you could land yourself behind bars. It's a jailable offense, but there's even more serious reasons why you should never swim in this. The Hoover Dam is used to make a lot of electricity, and this means you could easily get an electric shock underwater. Of course, that would mean instant doom for anyone in the water. In 2017, a Welsh man named Aaron Hughes dived into the Hoover Dam. Amazingly, he actually lived and was arrested. The authorities said they were stunned that he survived. That's because everyone else who tried it has been sucked into the intakes and some have even been sucked into the Bellmouth spillways. I'm glad to see Aaron is putting whales on the map. Nile River, Africa. The Nile River is the largest river in the world. It goes through many African countries, but we all know the biblical story of the baby left in the River Nile. Well, if you tried that today, then the baby would not make it to the other side. The Nile is full of crocodiles, only you won't see them coming because of the very clouded water they use to hide from their prey. It may surprise you, but every year, hundreds are taken out by crocodiles in the Nile. That's more than 10 times the number of shark incidents in the USA per year. Hanakapia Beach, USA this beach is located in Hawaii, but it's not the normal peaceful Hawaiian beach you'd love to spend a vacation on. Underneath this beach are very strong riptides, and they've led to more than 80 people losing their lives. The beach is so dangerous it even has an infamous sign scaring swimmers away, and the prison-style tally marks on the sign are to count how many people have lost their lives at this beach. But now it's time to make your voice heard. Which body of water did you find most scary? Apocalypse.